Well, we're up here recording at the moment for Camper Trailer Lifestyle in the Victorian high country. And for me personally, a trip to the high country will never be complete without dropping into the Dargo pub for a couple of cold beers. Now, I've caught up with Helen, who's the new owner here, but there's a bit of a story because you're the new and the old owner, aren't you? Yes, we are. Yeah. So what's the story behind that? So bought the hotel back when I was 24. 1993. Um, wasn't much of a going concern back then. It was doors were closed more than they were open. Um, bought it with my husband at the time, and yeah, we got the business back up and going. Got busier and busier, and decided our lounge for 10, 15 people wasn't going to be big enough. So um, yeah, we pulled out all the accommodation to cater for more tourists. Built some log cabins. And they were all done in 98. So who do you find dropping into the pub now? Lots of tourists, four wheel drives, motorbikes, um, even get a lot of push bikes up here as well. The old horse rider still ventures this way, people doing the, the national trail, locals. So yeah, but a lot of tourists from all over Australia. So you sold the pub when? Leased it out in 2000. So I'm fourth generation local to the area. Um, so I haven't moved away, leased it out and then sold the freehold in 2004. And then, yeah, still lived here, uh, have kids and took them off to school and backward and forward. Still loved coming to the pub, was definitely here every weekend. Um, on the other side of the bar though, not the inside. So yeah, the kids are older now and finishing school and looking for something to do and the pub had been up for lease for a while. We thought, yeah, well if we can get the whole lot back, we'll take it back on board. So that's what happened 18 months ago. Are you loving it? Love it. Yeah, it's home for me. It's definitely a passion. Love the building. Want people to love and respect it as much as what we do. Bring back the, the love and the feel for the place. Clean it up a bit, like make it nice and modern, like modern but old. We have a great outdoor area at the back now. We've just redone the outdoor area. That was six months ago. Um, so that's a great place for private functions. So we can lock that out. We've got quite a few weddings booked up between now and Christmas, a few parties. It's great, it's home. So you can book out the outside area for private functions. Yep. You've got accommodation here for everyone. For the four-wheel driver, they can drop in and get a bit of local knowledge about what's happening around the place. For sure. And of course, a cold beer. Yep. And, and apparently, a pretty good feed. Yeah, how was your lunch? My lunch was nothing short of spectacular. <laughs> great, <laughs> great. It was really good. That's There's good. a good menu, good feed, and actually I'll challenge you to eat the whole lot on the plate because it's a big feed. That is a big feed. So make sure when you're in the area, you drop into the Dargo Hotel, check out all the facilities and enjoy a couple of cold beers and a meal.